Hello my lovelies, it's Natasha here and I am coming to you from Salt Lake City. <laughs> I have decided to tag along on another one of Ben's work trips and so we're going to be exploring Salt Lake City together. We're going to make sure we can get some self-care time, relax while we go explore the city. We'll get dressed up. I'll show you some of my outfits and it's just gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. And I'm glad that you guys can come along with me. Biscuits and gravy. Oh my gosh. And an Irish stew. What? Keep doing that. I'm going to use your footage for my videos. No. <laughs> You're not well, allowed. You're doing a good job. Keep it up. <laughs> It's what, 6 p.m. over here? Right now, I just took a shower. As you can see, I'm in my PJs already. We were planning on going out to dinner tonight and maybe exploring a bit, but honestly, we're both so tired. We woke up at 5.30 a.m. this morning to go catch our flight. So it's been a long day. And when I was younger, I would have probably gotten upset at myself for like wasting a travel day, just like hanging out inside the hotel. But honestly, sometimes you've just got to listen to your body. And now I'm like, if I'm feeling low energy, I'm not going to push myself to go out and socialize. I'd rather just relax here. And then tomorrow is a new day and we can go out and explore. I was working from our hotel room today too. I did not take the day off, so it's been a busy day. So Ben and I decided to just chill here, watch some TV. We were watching The Office just now because we both love The Office, obsessed. Any Office fans watching? So we've been watching that and then we just ordered Uber Eats to our hotel room <laughs> so that we don't have to leave and we can just relax and have a lazy night in and get ourselves well rested for tomorrow. Sometimes you just need to relax. There's nothing wrong with that, even when you're traveling. We're so introverted. First night <laughs> inside. First night in Salt Lake City, and we order Uber Eats inside the hotel. We're gonna eat Uber Eats and watch Attack on Titan. <laughs> and watch Attack on Titan on my laptop. Um, We've never really been into anime, but a friend of ours, Paul, shout out to Paul, um, recommended it to us and now we are obsessed. Like, we've been binge watching it. So if you haven't watched Attack on Titan, go check it out. Um, but yeah, it's dinner time. <laughs> First night in Salt Lake City and we will be dining in. It's day two. Um, it is currently 10.30 in the morning. I'm actually working from our hotel room. I'm working a half day, so I've got my laptop over here. So I'm working for a few hours. And then I'm actually going to meet with 
some uh, team members uh, from my job that actually live nearby in Salt Lake City. And we're gonna get brunch, so that's gonna be fun. And then I'm actually gonna get out of the hotel room and explore the city a bit, <laughs> since all we did was hang out in the hotel room last night. Sometimes, you know, you just, you just gotta do you and rest <laughs> and order Uber Eats and watch Netflix or stream a movie on um, your laptop instead of going out. So I'm excited. Um, there's a mall here and I'm actually wondering if they have a Zara because there's these pants from them that I want to try on because I don't trust their sizing online. So I'm going to see if they have a Zara at the mall. If not, I'll just walk around and explore the city a bit. But yeah, I'm a lot more well rested today, especially since we haven't done much. We just walked to a coffee shop to get some coffee earlier this morning and now Ben's at his conference. So I've been just resting here and getting some work done. But yeah, we're gonna explore. We're going to explore today, I promise you. <laughs> Hi guys. As per usual, very on brand for me, I lost track of time. And so I had to hurry to get dressed because like I said, I'm gonna meet with some of my coworkers that live here um, and it started raining. So I was like, oh, I'm gonna walk there, but now I have to get an Uber and now hopefully I'm not running late, but you know, it is what it is. I have a reservation so, but this is the outfit. You can't really see it, but I'm wearing my faux leather jacket. I got it for like $40 on Shein. Don't, don't judge me. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Here's a better look of the outfit. Uh, wearing my high-waisted straight leg rib cage jeans from Levi. I have this cute little striped turtleneck and then my faux leather jacket. And of course my trusty white sneakers that I've worn to death, but they're comfortable. <laughs> Let's get going, cause I'm gonna be late. How cute is this spot? Like what? This is so adorable. Just walking around exploring, finished having brunch with my co-workers and now getting some fresh air. Guys, I am so lost right now. I have no idea where I'm going. Not me spending a good chunk of my first full day in Salt Lake City walking around malls. <laughs> like, why? I was on the Uber ride back to the hotel, which I'm back now, and I was like, wow, I probably should have done something else, but you know what? I got some new clothes. <laughs> I don't know how I'm gonna fit it in my luggage because there's not a lot of space left, but we'll try. I ended up getting that um, floral, like pink and beige turtleneck and those satin pants, uh, the beige ones from H&M. And then I stopped at Madewell and I bought a pair of black jeans. <laughs> Treat yourself, guys. 
So I have three new pieces that I need to find out how I'm gonna fit them in my luggage. So here is the second outfit for the day. We're gonna head out to dinner soon with some friends. I've got this sheer turtleneck on. Of course, I'm wearing another turtleneck. Like, are you surprised? And these black jeans that I bought at Madewell a few hours ago. <laughs> they fit perfectly though. I think it's their perfect vintage jean. Um, and yeah, so I've got more of a all black and gray look for tonight. Look who it is. We're gonna eat beautiful day, cold. It is. Beautiful. It's very cold. nice. To go to dinner. I was gonna say ready for dinner, but I, you beat me to I, it. I beat you to it. He missed me. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow I speak. He does. And I'll have you there tomorrow. Yep. Saturday, day two. <laughs> I, it's fine. <laughs> speaking today today i am speaking about keto and it's yes. cold well you because you're just wearing your blazer right but look at his outfit show us your outfit ben wow are you excited i'm excited and i'm grateful anytime i could lecture share my work with people and inspire them, I'm grateful. And then I watch other speakers and your support. It's gonna be a great day. Yay. And I'm here too. I'm here for moral support. We're walking over to the venue now. Nibu, hope I'm saying his last name right. He has great research on, Navio is how you say it. He has great research on wartime metabolism, peacetime metabolism. If your body is in a stressful state, and that could be from excessive glucose and insulin, toxicity, mold, like Brian was spoke, speaking about, or whatever it is, the, the mitochondria see. Hi, I am back at the hotel room by myself for some much needed introvert time, especially after spending most of my morning and early afternoon at a conference, and then also going to <laughs> a pub slash restaurant that was packed because everybody was watching a basketball game. There was a lot of screaming, a lot of yelling, and I'm like, I'm just gonna go back. To the room now and like be in peace and quiet you know sometimes you just have to take a break and that's fine i'm feeling kind of low energy on this trip as well because there's a two hour time difference from utah to florida so both nights so far i've woken up at 5 a.m and then I wasn't able to fall back asleep because my body's probably like, oh, it's 7 a.m., time to wake up. And I'm like, no, <laughs> we're supposed to be sleeping, so we're not in Miami. So I've been just ugh, tired and I wanna explore more, but you know what? I'm not gonna get angry at myself. I'm sure I'll be back here another time. So I just need, I need time to just like relax and lay in the bed and do absolutely nothing. Going out to dinner, feeling tired. <laughs> I 
Oh, it smells nice in here. Ooh. Choo -choo. I found a book for me. It's very on brand. When you love a cat. What does it even say in here? When you love a cat, you are wanted for a snuggle in the night and on long afternoons. Just like that. Just like that with their butt sticking out. Well, that kind of looks like a chubby Milo. <laughs> walk now after our yummy dinner it, sun's about to set it was so good guys i had a honey lavender infused polenta cake with salmon out of this world but yeah we're gonna walk around there's a really pretty um cathedral that i saw that i want to go and look at because the architecture looks so beautiful but it's a nice day out Walking with my boo boo. I'm the boo boo. With the boo boo. <laughs> wow, it's so pretty. mountains oh so gorgeous that's the church that we just went inside which I call my where the things in my luggage that take up the most space so I can fit all of the clothes that I bought <laughs> on the trip but I think it still kind of matches this is actually a mini dress that I stuffed into my pants but yeah we're gonna go get breakfast and then we have to head back because Ben wants to watch the heat game at the hotel but yeah we fly back today I'm ready for breakfast to leave for the airport in a few minutes oh, I'm excited to just get home and sleep in my bed because I've been very low energy this trip I think it's a combination of me not sleeping well because of the time difference I'm so tired <laughs> but also I've had a really busy and stressful couple of weeks at work like the past few weeks so I feel like my energy was already low and then traveling just brought it down even lower. And like I said earlier in the video, when I was younger, I would have felt like total FOMO and been upset at myself. Like I'm in a new city, I need to explore. I need to just keep going, keep going. But then I would destroy my energy levels even more. So sometimes, you know, if you're low energy, you just gotta have a low energy day, even if that means not exploring as much. But we did walk around a bit. We got to see a couple of like historic sites. We ate some really good food. So we still got some, some time in to do some stuff, but oh, I'm just tired. I know this video was probably a little bit more chill, not that much exploring, but your girl has low energy this weekend. <laughs> I hope you found this video enjoyable though. If you enjoyed this video and you're new to this channel, I post videos about self-love and fashion every week. 
so you can go check those out on my channel as well. And if you enjoyed this video, I would appreciate it if you subscribed. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm ready to go back home to Miami. And that's it. That's all I've got. <laughs> Bye. Love you.